come down on the ground and we are going to do some 90-90 hip work. But before we do that, we are going to do a PRI technique to help reposition us closer to neutral. So we all have a functional cortical dominance and anatomical asymmetries that put us in a pattern. So we are only gonna do this technique on one side and this is how it goes. You are going to put your right hand, the whole palm on the ground. You are gonna let your right shoulder come up and you're gonna just stretch out this right side. With the pattern that we all get stuck in, the right shoulder is almost always down, rib cage compressed on this side, so we're trying to reverse that. Then I need you to take your pelvis, so like your zipper, and you're gonna turn it towards the left, your trail leg. Now, I need both of your knees to be on the ground firmly. If they are not, you're gonna grab a pillow or something so that you can get some firm pressure under your knee. My back knee is okay, but some people will need a pillow there. This one, I need a little something. Okay, so I am turned. We're gonna get our glute max on this side to get our pelvis there, ischiocondylar adductor on this side to help keep us there. You are also gonna take your left hand and we are gonna reach. Anytime we reach, it is because we're actually trying to get the rib cage back because most of us are compressed in the back of our left rib cage, that posterior mediastinum, we need our abs on this left side. So I want you to find your abs. You are crunching down on this side, rotating to this side. You are reaching forwards to bring those ribs back, crunch, crunch, crunch. We're doing five breath cycles. So easy breath in through the nose, long breath out, and you're gonna drive this knee into the ground, this knee into the ground, and find those left abdominals. Loud breath, audible through the mouth, long fall, empty. Okay, breathing in, nice and easy. And a long breath out. Crush this knee down, this knee down. Keep that pelvis turned. You're really sunk into this side, stretching it out, finding your left abs. Awesome. So that is repositioning your pelvis, your rib cage, finding some stability around your hips so you're gonna have better squats, deadlifts, everything. Okay, and it means we are really nicely set up for a 90-90 pails and rails for our right leg. Hi everyone. So if you liked this video and you want more free routines, classes, information, on mobility and physical longevity, go to movement101.ca or click the first link below. And if you like videos like this and you want more, hit like, click subscribe, or make a comment below. I love hearing your feedback. I love hearing about what you want more of. Thanks for watching.